They took him in. They raised him as their own. A Macomb County couple doing what families are supposed to do, helping each other. Yeah, but well, tragically, that same young man has been convicted of killing them. Local force Nick Monticelli joining us live now this morning. And Nick, I understand that it's sentencing day. Just a, a very wild and bizarre story. You know, it really is, and it really kind of threw the investigators here at Warren PD through a loop because of what was going on. It turns out that this man had a hit list for other family members. They had to move them to safety while their investigation was going on. But it took a jury in Macomb County just 12 hours to convict him of first degree murder. You understand that charge? When he faced a judge for the first time, Joseph Boriak showed no emotion and gave one word answers, accused of murdering his aunt and uncle. A Warren detective explained what officers found when they caught up to him on Ryan Road in Detroit. Taken into custody, he had blood spatter on his sweatshirt and a drop of blood on his eyeglasses. The medical examiner stated the cause of death was blunt force trauma. In June, Warren police found 67-year-old Steve Collins and his 66-year-old wife Cindy's front door kicked in. They were shot to death in separate rooms. Boriak has now been found guilty of murdering them, but it still isn't clear why. What we do know is his aunt and uncle helped raise him. Why would you murder people that actually raised you, cared about you, supported you, helped you, and then you go to their home and you viciously kill them. And I'm not sure we will ever have an answer to that. Now, it is worth noting that when the jury in Macomb County found him guilty, they also added a quick side note that said, but mentally ill. I've read Rhonda. Well, Nick, what exactly does that mean? But not a whole lot. What it means is that while he is serving his life sentence for first degree murder, he will get some additional mental health help. But that's about it. And mind you, his sentencing is today, but it's first degree murder. So that's an automatic life sentence. Mm -hmm. All right. What a tragedy. All right.